Hey, welcome back everybody. It's KB here and today I'm going to show you the amazing software for Windows 10 which lets you control the privacy and some settings which a lot of people don't like. So this video is a special video for those people who really don't like the Windows 10 for many reasons. Hopefully after using this software you will like Windows again. This is not official method but still you know you hate Windows 10 but you still use the Windows 10. Wish you had some kind of settings to disable few things like automatic update or something like that. Maybe that is the reason why you hate the Windows 10. So once you visit this site, I will put a link in the description. You can go there and visit this site. Here it says double O software shut up 10. So this is the software you have to download if you want to control the privacy and it also says here free anti-spy tool for Windows 10. That means if you are running a Windows 10 Microsoft is spying on you. They know a lot of things about you. I don't know how much but still you know it's not a like lie or something like that. It is true the Windows I mean Microsoft is spying on you if you use the Windows 10. Simple reason why they spy on us is that they want to improve the Windows 10 and for that they need data of us using it. So that is what spy is from the official statement. That's what they will say if we ask them why you spy us. So that is the only reason that we want to improve the Windows 10 and we have to do something. Okay, maybe there are more, more many reasons, but you know, you got it. So let's just talk about this software now. You can see here we have big download button here. We can click on it. We can download it. And if you want to read about this software, you can read. And if you want to see the official video of this software, you can also watch the video right here in the website. And you can read all of these things about the software. Okay, so I have already downloaded this and here it is so 00SU10 first thing the best thing about this software is that you don't have to install it it's a exe file you just have to run it and apply the settings and you will be good to go run as administrator make sure that you run as administrator if you don't run as administrator this software won't be able to make changes on your system so make sure that you are running as administrator and make sure that you are confident to use this use this only if you are annoyed of windows 10's features you know you want to disable some things only in that case and make sure that you are you have good knowledge of using softwares and using windows pc and something like that okay so i'm gonna run it because i know fair amount of things about the windows okay this is uh, this is the software uh we are looking at and here we have the all the option which we don't get in the windows settings you know we don't have the you know setting to uh block the microsoft spying us you know and uh, we don't have option to disable the automatic updates you know so those kind of settings are here now so how this works is that this software will make changes on your registry so make sure that you know if you apply any settings inside this make sure you create a system restore point so later on if you get any problem you can restore your system and everything will be okay so that's how this software is gonna work unless you know nothing is gonna go bad but you know for safety it is important make sure you do some kind of backup make restore point you know something like that so let's say you hate the automatic update and you want to disable it and there is no way you can disable it from the uh, settings in within the windows 10 but if you download this software and use it i'm gonna search for update we have a search box here and I'm just gonna search and as you can see here Windows update Windows update we are peer-to-peer -peer, disable and uh, we have a lot of options here we can just disable them activate uh, defender for update we can also disable that automatic driver updates we can disable that as you can see here uh, this is the main section here automatic Windows update disabled okay we can just turn it on and it will be disabled and it will make 
you know, uh, some editing in the registry. As you can see here, it says, it gives us a warning that, do you want to create a restore point? I recommend you guys to create it. Hit yes, and it will enable it. If you get any problem, you can restore your system uh, after, only if you get the problem, okay? So it is recommended. But, you know, I don't hate that much the Windows. I don't hate that much. So I don't need to disable the automatic update because I want to get the latest updates from the Windows 10. But if you are a gamer, you know, a lo lot of gamers hate the automatic update system in Windows 10. So that's why if you are a gamer like streamer or something like that, you can use this option to disable the automatic update. So when you're playing a game, you get the update and you won't get disturbed. Like it won't even receive the update. So that is the benefit of using this software and you know you can easily disable the automatic update of windows 10 so you got the option here and if you want to go back you know we have a switch on and after that you have a switch off button option here so it's easy it's not gonna hurt your system so always make sure that you create a system restore point so just like this i'm gonna assess term a restore point as you can see here so you don't actually have to go here and create a system point when you enable any option within this software as you can see here it asks for creating a system point if you click on yes and it will create a system point okay i don't want to disable any of the update of the windows 10 but i will show you which i don't want okay i'm gonna disable a few things for you because you know maybe as you can see here, I have disabled some things. Disable the Windows Customer Experience Improvement Program. This is a spy system, you know. So if you want to make it easy, if you are new at this software, you don't know what you're doing, you can click on action button here. As you can see here, it says apply only recommended settings. As you can see here in the right side, we have a recommended option. Yes means fully recommended to turn off the setting and limited means uh, it is okay and no means it's not recommended but you can still turn it off okay because not recommended means like if I want to uh, disable the Windows 10 automatic update that means I won't be able to get any future updates my Windows 10 will never update again so that is not recommended because uh, OS needs to be updated constantly. So that's why they say it's, it is not recommended. But as I said, you can turn it on at any time, turn it off anytime. So there is no need to worry about anything. So as I was saying, go into the action and after that you can just simply apply only recommended settings or recommended uh, somewhat recommended settings okay and apply all settings you can just do that and if you have done anything wrong you can always undo all changes okay and you can also create a restore point before you do anything within the software amazing okay they have the safety features they have the uh, anti-spy settings and everything so this is pretty amazing tool for those people who really hate windows 10 for you know many reasons as i said windows update they are spying on us you can turn off any of the spying things settings you know so uh, for example this one the windows customer experience something so you can also see the description here what it says about the setting you're about to turn off or on okay so now we will talk less and uh, i'm gonna try my best to explain you this software fast as fast possible so we have the first section privacy all the things uh, to do with your privacy you you can change it here and app privacy we have a security we have a web browser microsoft edge settings synchronized settings and cortana and great thing sometimes i see that cortana is using a lot of cpu and ram so i sometimes i feel like i should disable the cortana if i'm playing the game so if you're playing game and you want to get all the resources for the game not for other software like cortana you can disable it there is no option to disable the cortana completely so 
within this software you can do this so you can see here cortana you can disable all of the settings of cortana completely just dead cortana make it dead cortana in the windows 10 amazing and location service use behavior windows update so this is the most important for gamers or you know a lot of people hate the windows 10's automatic update because you don't have option to disable it so this is this will be really important for you and uh, yeah we have a lot of options here now it's up to you what you want to do with this software you know you are forced to use the windows 10 but you don't like the feature of windows 10 you want to turn them off then this is the only software which will help you to do that so maybe using this software you will love windows 10 again and one more time this is not an official software to turn off the things you know it, this is unofficial but people are using it i have seen a lot of people using this software to turn off many settings in the windows 10 and protecting their privacy so that is the main reason you know people are hating the windows 10 because of the update and privacy things you know so yeah that's it uh if you have any question you can leave a comment i will reply your comment guaranteed and i will try my best to help you in the comment section below okay so as i said i don't hate windows 10 I, maybe i hate but i don't like to you know i'm not a it's like not a huge deal for me yet yet it's not a huge deal for me i can handle the windows 10 whatever they have in the windows 10 automatic update i can handle it i check my pc every time i log in for the update so i don't get interrupted while i'm playing the game so that's how it goes but i like it okay so i'm not saying that i hate the windows 10 and i'm gonna use it something like that yeah um, for some reason some if i want to i will use it i ha i am using it some things as you can see here some options are disabled and you can also find some options within the settings so it has a lot of settings some option which are not available in the settings they have the option within the software some settings are also in the settings but you can't find it easily they also have it within the software so yeah uh, i think i talk too much but the people who hate windows 10 maybe they will start loving the windows 10 because you know there is no other os like windows 10 for gaming so main reason is the gaming because you know the only system you can game on is windows and latest is windows 10 so you can use the windows 7 if you want to yeah i'm gonna leave a link in the description for this software you can go there and download this software and protect your privacy or disable the windows 10 automatic update something like that and do not hate windows 10 love it because <laughs> this is like the the biggest os in the world and you cannot deny it doesn't matter how hard or how much you hate it the windows 10 is you know the biggest os for everything from gaming to productivity so you know product for productivity you may feel like you want to use the mac os but the problem with the mac os is that it's super expensive okay uh if you have money i don't mind but like i never had a mac os never 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 maybe never will only if i have money i would just i will buy the mac os only if i have money and only to test the mac os that will be the only reason if i will ever buy the mac os or maybe for my children because mac os is more secure more stable than the windows so it's like I'm, I, I don't hate Mac, I don't hate, but the things you can do on Windows, you can't do in Mac. Actually, you can do it. There is a bootcamp system on the Mac and you can install the Windows 10 on it and you can run both Mac OS and the Windows 10 in it. So that is amazing feature officially by the uh, Apple. So I, I'm not going to go deep into the these things, but you got the idea what am I talking about. Okay, so that's it. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. And yeah.